Deputy Prime Minister Teo Shihien has paid tribute to Home Team officers for their commitment to serve the country. But he also took the opportunity to urge them to work together to put things right. The minister was speaking to some 450 Home Team officers at a National Day observance ceremony earlier today. Tan Chui reports. <laughs> team was reminded of its mission to the country in the light of recent setbacks. From time to time, there may be individual officers who fall short of the high standards that we have set for ourselves and which Singaporeans expect of home team officers. Those who have done wrong will be taken to task, regardless of their position or their seniority. At the same time, we should reflect on what went wrong and work together as one home team to put things right. We must never lose sight of our mission to keep Singapore and Singaporeans safe and secure. In his National Day message to the home team, Mr. Teo also paid tribute to the officers who performed their duties round the clock and in all conditions, including when the haze was at its worst in June. Reflecting this commitment to serve, 104 officers were honoured with the Home Affairs Minister's National Day Award this year. One of them is Captain Norazam of the newly formed Civil Defence Force Marine Command. Coming from a non-marine background, uh, for most of us, uh, we really had a steep learning curve uh, to actually quickly learn uh, and adapt to the marine environment so that uh, our guys are actually fully trained and competent to handle situations during any emergencies I see. Also recognised was prison psychologist Lin Xiang Bin, who works with prison inmates with a history of violence. What motivates me to go to work every morning is um, the opportunity to meet inmates, uh, to talk to them and to offer them uh, different possibilities of how their lives can turn out um, when they get out of prison. 12-year-old Nurul Ifa Arafin was the youngest recipient of the Public Spiritedness Award. She helped civil defence officers put out a fire in the rubbish chute of her HDB block. In all, 62 members of the public were recognised for acts ranging from helping police tackle loan shark runners to saving lives.